<laughs> you gotta do it again. All right, I got you. So shouts out to Aurelius and Aurelius Kingdom. But so if you ever do your uh, your YouTube intro, your content, whatever, it'll be like A R A I L Y U S K. Hey. <laughs> what? I hey. love it. That thing is fire. Hey y'all. Uh, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Aurelius. Um I hope you stick around. Well, at least check out the first video and see what you think and decide if you want to stick around. Um, today's video was a pretty fun video. Um, it's actually um, sponsored by BetterHelp. Um, if you do not know who BetterHelp is, just hold on and I will tell you all about it. But Today's video is all about romanticizing your life. So, if you do not know anything about me, I am on like a spiritual journey. I'm on like this. I'm on this journey to be the better version of myself, you know, with God's help. And I just want to be the best version of myself that I can be. And, you know, it just happens that in this season of my life, you know, I just happen to be alone. And I have accepted that this is where God wants me. Um, But God is good <laughs> because... Um, not bragging, but, you know, God has blessed me to be able to romanticize my life, take care of myself, treat myself, do nice things for myself, which is very important as a part of mental health. And that is where our <laughs> sponsor, Better Help, comes in, so... If you do not know anything about BetterHelp, they are a licensed online therapist. They um, connect you with support, with professionals, with support anytime, daytime, nighttime, um, telephone, text, video, you know, they, they work with your schedule, you know, um... The thing that I like about therapy is that it equips you with the tools that you need to navigate life. Um, if this is one of your your if this is your first time seeing one of my videos, I do live with multiple mental disorders. So therapy is a part of my life because of my mental disorders. But to be honest, I feel like even if I didn't have mental disorders, I would still use therapy because everybody needs somebody to talk to. You know, everybody can use the help of somebody's an outsider's perspective into your life. It can help you figure things out, you know. So I feel like therapy is good for anybody. So if you are interested in trying it, Use my link down below for some money off when you sign up. So, again, thanks to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. And, yeah, let's get into this vlog. Hey, boo. <laughs> she must have knew I was about to pick up this camera. <laughs> She's been outside literally all day. <laughs> hey, y'all. It's Aurelius. If you have never seen my face, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Um, So, what I'm going to make this into a vlog. Like, um, I have something going on this weekend. Um, and I'm going to make it into a vlog. <laughs> the problem is I will record it. I know I have no problem recording. The problem is the editing. <laughs> but I'm going to try to do this. I'm going to try to get this right. So, 
Today is Wednesday, February 28th. Yeah. Today is Wednesday, February 28th. Yeah. So, I am going to a concert and I am trying to figure out my outfit. So, um... I'm not sure if I want to show y'all, but then I do. So, okay, if you've never seen one of my videos, I have a lot of mental disorders, and my ADHD a lot of times get the best of me. <laughs> my ADHD and my OCD get the best of me when it comes to make deci making decisions and staying on track and stuff. <laughs> So, my mind literally be all over the place. So, I say, if you come to my channel, put on your seatbelt, baby. <laughs> if this is your first time on my channel, I pretty much make lifestyle content from a mental health perspective. And I love fashion. Absolutely love fashion. Have always loved fashion my whole life. Um... I mean, I just, I just record what's going on in my life, to be honest. And like I said, there are multiple mental disorders going on. So, you know, my content may be all over the place. But if you know anything about mental health or mental disorders, that's mental disorders. So, um, if it's something you think you'll be interested in. Um, I feel like people need to see this side of mental health, you know, literally how it affects people on a day-to-day -day basis, you know. But, <laughs> so if you think that's something that you would be interested in, I hope you will hit the subscribe button. <laughs> I would love to have you as a part of the family. Um, my little channel is finally starting to grow. I'm so excited, so... Yay. <laughs> so let me get this content out. So, um, yeah, the outfit I have on, I got this dress from Marshall, not Marshall's, TJ Maxx. And I didn't try it on. I was kind of rushing because it was kind of late, but I picked it up in a large. And I mean, of course, a large fits, but I need a medium because the medium will snatch me. Like this large has a lot. It's it's not spandex. It looks like it's spandex. I might as well just show y'all. Well, I don't want to show y'all because I want y'all to see when I do my outfit on Saturday. But anyway, <laughs> there she go. Whew. But I think it's so cute in the boots that I have on with it. Oh my God, it's so cute. This, this, I mean, you can only see what's up here. So you like, I don't know what she's talking about, but the outfit is cute. Trust me. <laughs> so I think I'm going to take this dress bag and get a size medium. But then I had one other option. So... Let me see what the other option, how I feel about the other option. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't show y'all this dress, <laughs> even if I could. <laughs> I never even wore this dress. And when I tell y'all this dress is so tight, it's so tight. Like to the point, I feel like even before I gained weight, this dress would have been tight. So, but... This dress came from Rainbow, and Rainbow don't have a dressing room. That is so crazy. But, yeah, I never tried it on, and when I finally tried it on, it's too small. Okay, <laughs> let's see what else we have. Okay, this dress don't look bad. And damn, the body look. The body looks amazing in this dress. Dang. Ah, I might need to wear this dress. Whew. 
Dang, the other dress was so cute though. But you know what? I could still take it and wear it the next day. Yeah, it just won't be a concert. It won't be the concert outfit. But I think this dress, and I could still wear my boots. Oh yeah, yeah. Ooh. So, no, girl, leave my glasses alone. That's my kid, <laughs> um, Miss Vixen. <laughs> she literally thinks she runs things, but she doesn't. Um, I value her opinion, but she doesn't run things. <laughs> but yeah, um, dang, I was about to go and return. I mean, I still need to go return the dress, but. What time is it? Do I feel like going? I don't feel like going nowhere. This dress. Ah, oh, this looks so good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, with the boot. Yeah. And the hair. We're going to get the hair fixed this weekend. <laughs> I'm going to get this fixed. But oh. y'all got a little sneak peek. This is so pretty. All right, y'all. I'll be back a little bit later. This is my little OOTD. I've worn these jeans before. I don't, y'all. I guess because I'm just a straight leg, a skinny leg, skinny jean girl. Like, I don't know. I feel like I'm forcing myself to, to like this trend. But the top says vintage 1981. <laughs> I am an 80s baby. I got this little crop jacket in. Literally, it's the same color. <laughs> and all this, the jacket, the top, and the jeans, all came from Shein. Um, this bag, it's really cute. It came from this um boutique in McDonough. I'll have to put the name of it on the screen. But I like that. But yeah, I'm going to come back and clean up my room later. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so it is today's Thursday, so I'm going to start packing, and I'm packing now because I'm very, very, very forgetful, and I don't want to forget anything, so I'm starting now, but as you can tell, there's going to be a theme for this weekend. I mean, technically, it's only two days, Saturday and Sunday, you know, whatever, but we're doing a theme, like... That's my bag that I'm taking, that little um, Betsy Johnson bag. That's um the only bag I'm taking, so I got to fit everything in there. So, it made sense to pick outfits that I could wear the same shoes. Because these are the shoes. I love these boots. I got them from Charlotte Russe. I think I got them from Charlotte Russe. <laughs> And this bag, y'all, Jeronica Masia, she showed this bag on her YouTube channel. And um, I forgot the bag that she said this is the dupe for, but um, I'll put it on the screen if I can think of it. But I went in my TJ Maxx because that's where she got hers from. It was the last one, and just like she said, this bag was $29.99. And y'all, this bag is so cute. It is so cute. It is everything that she said about it. <laughs> so I love it. Um, it's the cream color. It has the gold details. It has the little gold on the side, and it also came with a chain. So you can wear it as a crossbody, but 
I'm pretty sure I'm not going to wear it that way. But, yes, y'all. This bag is so cute. So, I mean, even my pajamas, that little pajama set, I think, came from Timu. But it's the same color, too. We doing a theme, y'all. This cardigan, I've probably had for a few years. It's from the brand Pink Rose. So, that means um, it either came from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. This bodysuit um, came from Forever 21. This is a small medium. That's the size they told me I needed. So, I got that. This dress, I don't want y'all to see it yet. That's why I have it like that. But, <laughs> this dress came from a um, store in the mall. I think it's called No Style. I think that's the name of the store. But, that's where that dress came from. This cardigan came from... Um, is it It's Fashion? City Trends? One, one of them stores. It's Fashion? I don't know. Whatever store it is, I'll try to put the name of it. But this that's where I got this cardigan from. This one, I think, is a small. Yeah, because that's the only size they had. And I'm not going to lie because <laughs> I am definitely not a small. I can fit it, but it's kind of tight on the arms. I'm not going to lie, but I'm going to wear it anyway um this little dress is the one i had on yesterday that i got from tj maxx and y'all i went back to tj maxx this dress is a large um so i went back to get a medium could not find a medium anywhere so i just kept it it's from the brand sincerely jewels and it was $19.99 I even went on TJ Maxx website to try to find this dress in a medium. They did not have it. But because I'm wearing this cardigan over it, like, um, I was just about to say, girl, I've been doing all this talking and was not even recording. Oh my God. Who got us good? <laughs> I was going to just throw the phone. But yes, um, yeah, I even went on the website to try to find, uh, um, medium but yeah because the cardigan is gonna cover it up like it, it's gonna be okay that this dress doesn't like suck me in i mean it still looks good but a medium would have y'all know what i mean a medium would have really really like snatched me and again the boots like i said came from charlotte Russe. the boots are going to go with all these outfits so this is what I'm packing, but I also want to show you this bag that I also bought from TJ Maxx. Did not need it, of course, but it was so cute, so gorgeous. It is an Aldo bag. And y'all, this bag is so cute to me. It has the gold detail, the little ribbon that I love, the top handle, and this one even has a zipper and the logo on the back and this auto bag you know compared to 55 was 35 so i got this one let me show you the inside so of course it's not large but it's fine it's 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 just enough <laughs> to carry like as an evening bag so it has the auto logo on the inside it comes with the chain it does come with a chain and take the stuffing out and that's about how much space you have on the inside which will hold my phone and a wallet and lip gloss keys yeah a couple dollars hand sanitizer whatever else you need to have in there your girly stuff, whatever. It's 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 enough size. It's big enough for all that. So, but yeah, this is the strap. So, yeah, that's so cute. I'm gonna find an event. When I say event, I just mean a reason <laughs> to wear this little bag because it's so cute. So yeah. Hey, uh, T 
today is Friday. We are on our way to the BET. <laughs> um, this little girl, she had she had one ringworm, right? And I was putting the stuff on there that they told me to put on there, and it seemed like it was getting better. Well, the other day when I looked, she now has two. So they told me to bring her in so they can give her like this bath or whatever. Um, and I don't know why I feel like she know where we're going because I mean she's been meowing like the whole time. She's calm now, but yeah. But we're on our way there. Of course we're late, but. I'm hoping that I can just drop her off and come back and pick her up. I hadn't planned on staying there. But, um, I feel like I got some more stuff to do. I know I have a therapy appointment at 1, 12. Yeah, so I got to get ready for that. And I want to say I got something else later on. Y'all, I am actually, I'm meeting with a financial advisor this evening. I want to say it's something I got to do around three, but I'm um, meeting up with this financial advisor um, tonight. And we're going to talk about, you know, budgeting, investing, planning for my future and stuff like that. Um, I'm pretty sure I have shared this before. I have a shopping problem, <laughs> I do. So, um, to keep from having all this free cash flow, cause I mean, to a certain point I'm disciplined, but on the other hand, if I see something I want, I'd be like, I'm gonna get it. So I just feel like if I have less money on me, then, um, that'll be less money I spend. And so having less money on me means I have more money to invest. I'm trying to think about my future, y'all. I'm trying to get my shit together. But, I don't know. I'm gonna have to look at my calendar. I feel like I have something that to go drop her off and I'll be back later. Okay, just dropped her off. Have to come back and pick her up. And y'all, <laughs> I feel like I'm, I have the right to say this. <laughs> this damn bipolar weather. <laughs> Literally, it was just a beautiful, warm, pretty day yesterday. And today it is 44 degrees. Like, ah! Uh, you can't tell, but I have on a dress, but I put this little sweater thing on top of it. I wonder what's that way. Let me go that way. I put this little sweater thing on top of it, but it is cold. So I have about 30 minutes before my appointment. So I'm about to go find me something to eat. and get ready for this appointment. So that was the only other appointment I had. But all right, y'all. I just wanted to give y'all a little update. I gotta come back and pick her up. They told me to come and pick her back up around three. So. That'll give me enough time to do everything I need to do. Oh, wow. 
Ooh, the skin is so pretty. I started taking this um, strap off and I realized I didn't show y'all this bag. So actually, if y'all remember um, the bag I showed y'all the other day, I found it on Amazon for $16, right? So I said I was going to return it. But when I just went to TJ Maxx today, I actually saw this bag. And this is a Kendall and Kylie and this little bag was only twenty dollars where's the tag this little bag was only 20 and it matches my shoes my shoes are dirty but <laughs> it matches my shoes and it has a k on there and if anybody asks the k stand for kingdom <laughs> but um yeah i'm laughing y'all but i really oh god I'll tell y'all about it a little bit later. I don't want to talk about it right now. But, yeah, this is the bag I'm going to carry. So, it is 540. I think I'm about to start getting ready. Surprisingly, the place where the concert is is not far from here. So, I don't know why I thought I was, like, way on the other side of Atlanta, but... Apparently, the place is not far from here, so I have a little bit of time to get ready. So, I'm a, I'm about to go start getting ready. The downstairs, y'all, is so cute. So, I'm going to take some pictures down there. And, yeah. I don't want to be on camera, y'all, right now. Like, I just, I'm sorry. I just... <laughs> Hey, uh, <laughs> it is almost one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I just got through eating my curry. It was so good. It was so good. It was expensive. That lady said it was twenty five dollars. I said, "Do you get a military discount?" She started laughing. I was dead ass serious. It was good though, but y'all, that concert. 
Look, J. Howell fans, J. Howell fans, they love him. The guy that sat next to me, he was like, this was his third show. And he was like, I'm going to keep going to his show. That man put on the show. The way he sound on his on his album, that's how he sound. When he do that real high, that, oh, I love it. And him and Dondria song, my song, Why You Love Me. Oh, my God. I love that song. That is my song. And when I took my picture with Dondria, I told her about that. I was like, girl, that song is for toxic relationships. I said, girl, I sent that song to my toxic ex. And we were laughing about it. But, y'all, I want to say he sung damn near every song on both of his albums. Like... He sung a lot of songs. Um, he did say he said it was something going on with the sound or whatever, but I'm trying to do this where the lighting is not so bad. He said it was something with the sound or something like that, but y'all, that was a good concert. I would go see Jay Howell again. They said at the beginning of his concert, ain't no sand die, bitch. We was standing up down at that whole concert. And y'all saw the shoes I had on. They were not heels. However, I had been walking around in them shoes all day today. And yes, I was standing up for a while at the concert. So by the time we made it to the after party and it was time, we was standing in line to get our picture. This left knee was like, um, okay, Aries, it's time for you to sit down. <laughs> so, yeah, I am back, back at the hotel. I am getting ready to go to bed. I'm so tired. This has been such a good day. The guys tried to scam me, but God is good because it didn't happen. The only thing that bothers me is that it almost did. Like, you know what I'm saying? I was like, wow, they almost got me. You know, I feel like, to be honest, I feel like God intervened. And that's the reason why they didn't scam me. But, yeah, the guys almost tried. They almost scammed me. And that is just so crazy. Like, God is good. God is good. Good. I'm going home tomorrow. Well, today. <laughs> but um, I'm trying to see. I think I want to go to one of my favorite restaurants. But I haven't been to the one in Georgia. I used to go to this restaurant in when I lived in Florida. So I'm going to see about going to it tomorrow. But I'm about to go to bed, but y'all, that concert, I am in clue footage, but that concert, oh, that was such a good concert. Oh, wow, that was so good. <sighs> yeah. And he complimented my outfit. He told me I look so cute. Ah! <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm going to bed. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. <laughs>
Oh, you just want to be in my video. <laughs> Hey y'all, uh, I am back home, it's a lot later, I'm gonna make a separate video, but yeah, this, just, just know, living with mental disorders is rough, just just know that, and if you're a praying person, just say a little prayer for me, because this shit is hard. It's, it's really hard. Um, I am about to try to edit this video right now. I'm going to try so hard. I want to prove to myself that I can get this done. I'm going to try to get this done. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, <laughs> yeah. If you enjoy, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment, a word of encouragement, something. Subscribe if you have not already. I'll see y'all in the next video.